This is a mock OR room uh, that's now used for simulation uh, and for teaching purposes. You can just uh, practice getting a retractor, practice handing it, um, the forceps, handing it. In class, uh, we had to pass it to our uh, teachers and they, uh, they would say, they would give it back to us and say, no, that's not how you pass it. And they, they would make sure that we got the right motion. My name is uh, Carl Schumacher. I am a student in the IU uh, Health School of uh, Surgical Technologist. I started delivering linen and then I moved to Central Distribution, then I moved to Sims, and then I went to Anesthesia Assistant. I was an equipment specialist and I took equipment to the different OR rooms. And then I was like, hey, I talked myself out of becoming a surgical tech and then a couple people uh, influenced me and said, hey, you should really go. And so I applied and I got in. The IU program is 11 months. The hard part is learning some of the instrumentation, uh, learning some of the anatomy, uh, the specific anatomy. You go over it, but then everybody is different inside. Uh, and also learning how to uh, listen to the, the surgeons, because sometimes they talk loud and sometimes they don't, and so you gotta lean over and really have your ears, ears on to, to uh, get them what they need the first time. But when the doctor says, hey, hand me your retractor, I pick it up and I place it in his hand, and then I'm looking, making sure, uh, depending on what they're doing, I can get something ready if they need some uh, forceps to grab something, I give them that. Uh, if they need some scissors, I just put it in their hand. Working for a big company like IU Health, you get your foot in the door and then you can uh, wiggle your way. I started in the laundry room, now uh, OIA slash uh, student for being a surgical tech. So I mean, I've had a lot of jobs and you, you can do that if you put your mind to it.